Oh, what the fuck? That shit me up big time. Does he know I'm here? Oh, yeah, he does. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Ah! Oh, my God, I dodged him. Didn't dodge that, though. Ah! Oh my god. No. We need to run. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We need to find the grandma's room. Fuck. It's another snake room. Fuck, we need to get away from this twat. So I think we might have got away from him. Get over here. Where the hell is Grandma's room? Oh, we're near it. We dropped down there. Alright, round here. Sounds like that's where he might be, though. Let's close the door. Is he in there? He can't be. What was it? Oof, okay. We made it. Dear Mrs. Baker. Now have you... I hope he doesn't come to me while I'm reading this. <laughs> now have you been feeling recently? It's been a long time since you came in for your last checkup. I'm right to tell you that I finished examining your x-rays. Those dark areas in your cranium are fungus-like structures. Oof, that seem to be related to mold. The hallucinations and noises you said you've been hearing may be related to those growths. If your symptoms are due to fungal parasite, it must be removed before it's too late. I don't mean to scare you, but I am seriously concerned for your health. Please come to the hospital as soon as you... Read this letter. As your doctor, I strongly recommend you undergo th further tests. Crawford Lang, Thorbe General Hospital. God. So this is the old woman's room, the creepy old woman. That's the grandma. Surprise! Oh yeah, there's a chair. Shotgun shells. Don't know where Jack is, but what's that say? Oh, nice! Broken shotgun, that's exactly what we need. Sweet. I'm tired of chasing all these shitheads around your yard uh, around the yard. The next time one of our guests run away. Hide the dog heads. Oh wait. Hide the dog head believes so they can't get out of the house. <laughs> Let's hide them like this. <laughs> Living room, grandfather clock, we got that. The book in the re recreation room, we got that. The dissection room in the basement, we haven't got that. That's the last one we need. But now we have a shotgun, so we're gonna be able to take care of the enemies a little bit easier. We might be able to shoot Jack in the face with, ooh. Oh God, put that back down. Put that. Handgun bullets. Creepy hat. And chems. Might not want to take them chems. She might die. That's probably the only thing keeping her alive. Is the mold. Which is crazy when you think about it. Because this is the entire thing uh, Spencer wanted to create. In res well, from the beginning. Because he was dying. He wanted to be able to live forever. And that's basically what these dudes are going to be able to do. Um, Spencer's already dead now though. So it's too... What the fuck? But it's too late. Alright, we got a shotgun. Happy days. We'll go and get the real one now. Oh, wait a minute. My health is not looking good right now. Let's uh, heal up a little bit. Shit. Right, where do we want to go? 
Let's drop down there. I haven't been down here, I don't think. Oh, that's a shortcut back into the main area, isn't it? The first area. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, garage is locked. We need one more dog head. So it seems what we need to do now is we need to get down into the morgue and then into the dissection room for the final head. Now that we have the shotgun though, we should be able to get in there a little bit easier. Let's save the game real fast and uh, get a move on. Alright, cool. Get that collectible. Is there anything we can put away before we continue? No. But we can make another chem. Alright, let's go. Do you know what, actually? I don't know if we'll need the scorpion key now. Because I think there's only two doors for the scorpion key to be used. And we've used them on both of the doors. So I think for now, at least, we can put the scorpion key away to free up a slot. We also need to look for that treasure photo area. The, uh... Um, fireplace. We could check this area. This might be where the fireplace is. I'm gonna make my little girl proud. Oh, false. No, Stay there's not. There. No fireplace here, but I think he's seen me. Fucking bitch. I see you got a new weapon there, mate. Not like it's gonna help. I keep forgetting that wall that's broke that I can take. It's right behind me. Alright, mate. Fucking hell, he's right. This is so horrible when he's right behind you like this. I need him to. I'm gonna have to shoot him or something, aren't I, to stop him? Oh, no. Fuck you, Jack, you piss take. Off. Ah, you. Fuck off, Jack, you muppet. Fuck off. Ah. Uh. Fucking fall over. Fucking. I think so, mate. I said, need me again. Uh, shit. Right. This way. Uh, let's get it. Oh, ho, 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 yeah. We got a shotgun now. Lovely jubbly. Oh, ho, ho. Very nice. Right, let's put the fake shotgun in its place. How do I do it? Maybe I just have to click. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Now we got a shotgun. Right, so now we need to get down into basement which was this way all right nice all right to the basement we go then let's do this let's just make sure on the map yep all right let's do this basement time See if any more of these moldy fuckers pop out. Right, I think we're safe. Still locked from the other side. We've got everything in there. So yeah, seems like we've got to go through here then. 
try not to die. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Wish me luck, legends. Alright, so the shotgun's there if we need it. How many shots we got? Just a few. Right. Where did they come from last time? I think one came from over there. Don't see any. Oh, nope, I hear it. I heard one of them. Yep, there he is. What's he doing? Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. What the hell are they doing? Oh, oh, shh. We're right behind that fucking door. Watch it in case they spawn behind me or something. Yep, he's right there. And he's just gone into the floor. So they could come up behind me. Why the fuck are they? These are tricky little bastards. There's one there, just chilling. Two there. Bastard. Shit. Fucking mop it. Yeah, but oh crap. Fuck yes. That is what I'm talking about. That lovely shotgun. Oh my lord. Beautiful. Ricky needs to heal up though. Right, hopefully that's all of them. Even if it isn't, got my shotgun ready. Quite a few shots. But I'm prepared for the worst. Another two shots. I think we're okay for now. Strong meds. Right, well, let's get into the dissection room, shall we? Wait, what? It's locked? Ah, oh, I need a lock pick. Damn. And I don't have a lock pick. Shit. There might be a lock pick in here somewhere. And I definitely need to go in there, don't I? Yeah. Damn, okay. We're gonna have to find a lock pick then. Hmm. You'd think there'd be one in here if I need to get in there. Um, don't see one though. Hmm. Right, I'm gonna have to go for go and look for one then. Alright, if nothing interesting happens, um I'll be back with you legends when we get a lot pick. Alright, so I've right back I've arrived at the safe house. What I'm gonna do is um first I can combine some stuff. Strong first aid. 
up one of them. Alright, so we're gonna put that away. We'll put no we'll keep that. Got the treasure photo. But what I'm gonna do is these temporarily sharpened senses making items detection easy. So I'm gonna use one of these and um, see if I can find a uh, lot pick easier with with, uh, with that. So see where items are for a limited time. Okay. So quickly gonna pop that in there, that in there, save the game just in case I don't find it and then I can search again. Right, so now item detection should be easier it says. I mean I don't know how that's gonna work. Oh, okay there you go. Um, well I can't get outside there. Um, well, it shows three items, but they're all outside. Oh, here we go. Let's go upstairs. Oh, that's another room I can't go in, though. That's why. I need it to show me items in rooms I've actually been in. Just gonna have to run around quickly and... Here we go. Some uh, herb, I think that were. I'm inside there. Burner fuel. Nice. More chems, but I can't pick it up. There we go, can pick it up now. Um what else? And got an ammo in there. This is um kinda useful but kinda cheap at the same time. Oh one's knocking. I think it might have ran out. So I still didn't find a lot pick. Um, and I think that has ran out. Let me drop down here a minute. There's so something on my map showing. Right, oh, it's another lock pick. Damn. So we need two lot picks, one for that and one for for the main room. Where the hell are all the lot picks at? All right, I'll be back for you, legends. When I, I find a lot pick, then I suppose. Nico's hardware saw twenty five dollars. Rope thirty five dollars. They bought four. Pet collar twenty dollars. They bought twenty. Oh, okay. So they put collars on, on everyone. I guess my character's got a collar on. Subtotal $563. Okay. So they, they put collars on everyone. That's weird. Alright, anyway, yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys when uh, I find a bloody lockpick. A boot? Never line. Oh. That's the kid's shoe. Oh, this could be the fireplace with the uh, the gift. Yeah, this yeah this is it. What do we do though? This is definitely the the place. <gasps> Here we go. Nice steroids. The fuck? 
Okay. Got some steroids. Dramatically strengthens muscles and increases max health. Effects last indefinitely. Whoa. I'm not sure how that, if that's how steroids work, but <laughs> I'll take them. <laughs> Effects last indefinitely. Sweet. Oh, God. I'm injecting myself with steroids. Holy crap. Okay. Your max health has increased. Nice. Yes, yes, yes. Nice, nice, nice. Still looking for a lockpick, though. I mean, still haven't found the lockpick, but... Once again, I will see you legends when I find something new and or find the goddamn lockpick that I'm still looking for. Why are these changed? I feel like I'm missing something in this room because it's just... I don't know. Because I've looked for a lockpick now for like half an hour and I just can't find a lockpick anywhere. Um, I don't know. Read this note. Because that's Lucas. Not the guy who keeps trying to escape lots up. Because that's what I don't get. It just says, just remember three A's and a handprint. But what does he mean by that? Oh, there is actually a hampering on this. But I've opened all these and it doesn't do anything. Um, three A's and a hampering. Maybe the names? What are the names? Laura? Travis? William? That doesn't even have a name. Tamara? Three A's and a hampering. That has three A's. I don't get it though. So, alright, so maybe if we close. Oh, that does have a name. Sean. They all have A's in the name. But that has obviously. Whoa, what did I do? Did I just do it? Oh, mate, I did it. The handprint. Three A's. Oh, my. Now I feel like a right idiot. Oh, my God. Okay. So that's what it meant. Three A's and an handprint. I don't know what's going on with it. I'm actually kind of fearful to open this thing because I, I did actually open it last time, to be honest. Oh, 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 oh. No, no. Oh, oh. Oh my god, I wasn't actually expecting anything because I did actually open it before. Oh. oh my god. Jesus, okay, so three A's and a fucking hampering. Hampering, three A's in Tamaru it was, wasn't it? Yeah. Wow, okay. That was a puzzle that is actually really simple, but for whatever reason, I just didn't get it the first time I came here. What's this? Yeah, and there we go. The dissection room key, so I didn't even need a fucking lock pick. But now I don't have, don't have any room. Uh, combine. Sweet, now I have room. I also need to get rid of the Mia tape, because... Don't need it. I actually went back into the tape just to see if I could find anything in there, but I didn't find anything. But now we have the key. The dissection room key. Finally. Alright. Now we can finally advance. I'm keeping my gun out now, though, because there might be more shit around. Right, so... Let's get to the dissection room, then, and get that third... Um... Head. Oh, God. All right. How many shots we got? Eight. Alright, we're going in. Let's do this. Oh, ho, 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 here we go. Oh, 
what the fuck? Oh, is that the cop? I think that'll be a bit. Is that the cop's body? It looks like it could be. Something just stopped. More shotgun shells. Okay, something's gonna go down. Hopefully not me. All right. <laughs> All right, we got a nice amount of shots, so we should be okay. I think that is the cop. That yep, that's definitely the cop. I don't know why they've hung him up there, but they have. Been in there. Oh, okay. I feel so much better having this shotgun in my hands. More shotgun shells. Okay, okay. Herb. Oh, that scared me, it was just my ammo. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I think I remember this from one of the gameplay things. Locked. Yep, I definitely remember this from the gameplay trailer thing. I'm not going to spoil it if someone hasn't seen it, but yep. Ah, uh, this is going to be... It's gonna be bad. Oh, there's the officer. Should we check on him? Oh, what the hell? Poor deputy. What happened to him, though? Why does he look so... ...moldy? He better not come after me. I really don't trust it. Fuck it. You fucking grab me or something as I go out this fucking door. Okay, he didn't. <laughs> okay. I've, I like, I've, I've tried to explain how creepy this is when you're in VR, but it's so hard to explain. But it's just so creepy compared to just standardly playing the game. Like the best way I can explain it is like, just imagine you're actually in the game world, you're actually in the mansion yourself. And when you see an enemy, it's not just a flat enemy, it's like as if you stood right next to Jack or the enemies and they're like six feet tall. It's so incredibly fucking creepy. Oh, we got another door down here, another snake, I think. Yep, another snake door. We ain't going in there yet. Go in there. Oh. Some powder. That's such a puny knife. <laughs> okay, we need to get a move on. Oh, we don't even have enough room. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, we can combine. Look here. Yeah, boy! Fine. No one. Oh, hello, Jack. Bye-bye, Jack. Oh, shit. 